What's up? What's up? We playing DraftKings today. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. Let's get right into it. We ain't got no time to waste. Uh, appreciate you guys for checking in. I will be live streaming the Super Bowl, so make sure you subscribe to the channel. That's all I really got to say. But anyway, I got four lineups for you guys that uh, I'm going to lay on you. Uh, my first lineup is my um, New England Patriots lineup. I got Danny. I got Tom. Um, I got Brandon. And you got to pick another uh, player from the opposite team. So I went with uh, Troy Smith. I got the best bang for my buck. And then I picked the two best defensive players I could possibly get. All right, my second lineup. This one is the lineup that you would want to pick if you was trying to go go for it all. You know, you want both quarterbacks because you think it's going to be a high-scoring game, right? So you got to take both quarterbacks. And then on the flip side of thing, you want to take the two best receivers you can possibly get which should be the two number twos because if it's going to be a high scoring game nine times out of ten the number twos will either gain a lot of yards or they will get touchdowns so in that case I took Brandon Cook because you got Amandola he just came back you know he turned up last week and I took um what's your boy name uh it should be yeah Agar right there boom so the Eagles are kind of funny right you got Troy Smith and you got what Jeffries right that's one and two then you got Aguilar most of the time when Eagles score high, it's either going to be a lot of Hurts or a lot of Nelson Aguilar. So you want to take him, and plus you get bang for your buck. And then on the flip side of the thing, take the best two defensive players on New England and the Eagles. It really doesn't matter because it's going to be a high-scoring game, right? But possibility, interception, sack, stuff like that. But uh, anyway, this lineup over here, my third lineup, let me see what I got. I got Nick Flores, Jeffries. Uh, Alright, so this is my Philadelphia Eagle lineup. Basically take the best players from the Eagles teams and then boom, drop off with a um, New England Patriot. And I took Brandon Cooks because I wanted the best bang for my buck. So I went with Brandon Cooks. Um, it's not like the Patriots because most of the Patriot players are high. So you're wondering why I faded Grunk. You feel me? Grunk is like kind of iffy then. He had the little concussion thing. So, you know, you want to kind of chill with him. All right, so moving on to my next lineup. This lineup right here is my all-purpose balanced out. I'm trying to win some cash, not all the cash. This is a, I spent some money, so I want to at least get my money back lineup. So you want to kind of stay in the middle. So with that being said, you're not going to take not one quarterback. And the reason why you don't want to take a quarterback is because if New England does good and, and basically the Eagles are trash, you're going to mess up because you got foes. And then if... Uh, Eagles ended up winning the game, and then Patriots is trash. Same situation. That means you pick $12,000 Brady for nothing. So you fade both quarterbacks. It doesn't matter what they score. Your lineup is balanced now. So no matter if he scored 30, no matter if uh, foes have an amazing game and score 40, you're going to be balanced out with this lineup. So you take Jay Jahi, you take Amendola, you take Gronk this time because you're staying balanced. Um, and then you take Alshon Jeffries. Basically, I took the best two players from each team. And then um, you finish it off with the best two defensive players you can get, right? Because you got to be strong across the board. Now, with that being said, those are my lineups, right? That's DraftKings. Now, let's get this money. Y'all got y all, y all, no time to waste. I probably dropped this video 10 minutes before, so I'm out.